Starting off the episode with some good news, a baby Aranosaurus was found in California this week. So now we know that this species is not actually extinct, but is still alive. With that said, we'll now move into the subject of today's video, a dinosaur which is pretty famous amongst the community, the bone-headed Pachycephalosaurus. This dinosaur was originally from the Hell Creek Formation in North America, the same formation that Tyrannosaurus rex, Triceratops, and other many famous dinosaurs came from. But despite being from the Hell Creek Formation and being one of the more famous engine clones, there isn't a ton of information about it. We don't know the year it was cloned, but we do know that it was held on Isla Sorna for quite a while until the 2000s when Jurassic World was in early development. An exhibit was made for it when the park opened in 2005 and stayed open until 2015 when the park of course shut down. The feature that most identifies the Pachycephalosaurus is its large circular dome. This dome is made of 6 inch thick bone and is used against predators, other Pachycephalosaurs, or really whatever it deems as a threat. It's it's even been seen doing this against vehicles in certain instances, and yeah, it will absolutely crush them. But despite the reputation, they are not these terrible monsters. They are actually fairly nice herbivores and only attack when they are threatened. <laughs> but when they need to come off as threatening, they don't have any trouble with it. Sometime later, our drone turned back on, and the Pachycephalosaurus was still there, investigating it. It seems that despite their aggressive nature sometimes, these creatures are fairly docile and are curious. <laughs> Pachycephalosaurus have a fairly reasonable diet for a herbivore. They mainly like fruits, nuts, and other vegetation, although researchers found out they have a particular love for oranges for whatever reason. However, despite all the nice things about them, Pachycephalosauruses are exceedingly rare. Currently in a farm in Minnesota, there is one last remaining Pachycephalosaurus specimen that we at least know of, which is rather sad because the Pachycephalosauruses are very social creatures. Currently, she is living in an old ranch, although the owner have said that they plan on actually putting more dinosaurs in here if the state requires it. And although she is lonely, at least she is not in harm's way from any other predators. The green jungles of Sorna housed many dangers, like the infamous Spinosaurus, the wily Ceratosaurus, and many others. But this Pachycephalosaurus will only have to worry about the competition for plants and leaves, because this farm has said that they will only take in herbivores. But still, it is somewhat sad to see that this is the last Pachycephalosaurus that the world will ever know. But thank you all for watching this episode of Engine and Dinosaur Profile. Next time we will be talking about another small dinosaur, but this one is not alone, and that is not for the better. And ending on that note, remember, if something chases you, run.